Good morning ladies and gentlemen, I hope you are enjoying your day. What better way to start the day than inserting your key into your Duramax? I mean, I can only think of a few other things that I'd like to do other than this, but uh, that feels pretty good. I can't find the cap for my bottle. Found it. What's up, Poochie? Yeah. Whoa, 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 what? Which trailer are you welding? This one right here. Right. Yeah, this thing's broken, I guess. Just that? Yep. Is it shut all the way? One of Jake's parents' trailers broke. Well, just the door hinge part. For some reason, this isn't really uh, closing right yet sometimes. So they were reefing on a little too much and they broke the arm right off. There's the arm. So I just gotta clean it and weld it for them. Remember how Jake broke my other grinder? I, I got the parts in, I just haven't put them in the other grinder yet, so I'm just using this one. What are you working on? I just pressure wash it up a little bit cleaner. I pressure wash it after the last race, kind of crappy and in a hurry. What place are you coming last race? I got first place last race. <laughs> Not on this bike, on his mom's bike though. A Beta. Not a KTM. A good old Beta. <laughs> Just like that, she's all set. So Jake's trying to convince me to go down to West Virginia with these guys because they're going to West Virginia, they're gonna go riding and stuff. He, he He's trying to tell me that I should get out of this town because of the court, because of the judges, and because of the fines, so. Yeah. Do you guys think I should go to West Virginia? I think so. Rip up the Hatfield McCoy trails. What would I take, the Honda? That's yep. the only bike that runs. Take the Honda. I got a I got a rear fender for it that I could finally put on it because that one's been broken for like uh, how long? Yeah, but who knows? You might in the gnarly trails down in the mountains, you might flip over again. It's okay. We'll look classy. Leave, leave in the comment section below. We'll, we'll go from there. Today's one of those days. Mom, do you need anything from uh, Springville? Uh, what are you going a printer. Huh? A printer. Oh, nothing. Okay, my day isn't going that bad. I gotta get some diesel. Out of all the gas stations in this area, I have to say this one is my favorite because the fuel nozzle is like one and a half times the size, and it just fills the tank. The day continues to be wonderful. Complete sarcasm inserted in that last sentence. After spending two hours with a new printer, a few moments later. So I got that fixed. Now on the way there, something else happened. <laughs> my heat, okay, my air conditioning doesn't work. I have heat, I don't have air conditioning. But luckily enough for the passenger, the passenger has cooling. My side, however, heat. Now I want to thank the Lord Almighty for giving us this beautiful weather today, but it would have been better if it was cold and I and I could use some heat. But no, we rocked the windows down. So now I got my buddy Jason on the old text message giving me uh, advice on what to do and how to fix this. And we're gonna try this out. If it does or doesn't work, we're gonna just document it. Because I'm sure somebody else has a Duramax or somebody else has a Silverado and having these same symptoms. And we're gonna try to fix it right here, right now, just like we did the printer, just like we did, 
I guess we just bought a new printer. Got to read that first. So once I start the truck, we're going after that fuse right there. Hopefully we don't get shocked, but the vehicle will be running when I pull this because that's what the forum says. I'm gonna listen to the forum, even if I get shocked a little bit. Step one, make awesomeness. Turn on the vehicle, same thing. Step one, success. Step number two, turn on the air conditioning. Step number three, pull the fuse. Step number four, wait 30 seconds. Step number whatever we're on, we're turning off the Duramax. And the final step, replace our fuse. Oh yeah, you like that? Oh yeah. Now I trust that this is going to work, so I'm going to put this on right now. Now that I said that, this will not work. Leave in the comment section right now. Do you think it worked or do you think it did not work? Right now. Come on. It did not work. It's a bigger issue. Don't get me wrong, I'm not going to take this day being screwed up in a completely horrendous way. I'll simply get ticked off a little bit here and there, and then get back onto my optimistic point of view, like I am right here. Basically, all it comes down to is you need to have bad days to appreciate the good days, right? If you didn't have a bad day, the good days would feel like crap too. Now by the YouTube video I watched, this should be the right actuator blend. I'm gonna keep it apart like this, then I'm going to plug it in and see how it reacts. See if it works, see if it's broken. Place that. Play dad. Good girl. The guy that I bought this truck from said the guy before him did smoke. I believe it. Gonna need a rag. Bam! 3D machines cleaning ashes out of Duramaxes since 2017. Represent. I think that's inside door, right? There we go. That's how it's supposed to. Oh my goodness. That's right. I still gotta get the part. Well, at least this looks good. <laughs> <laughs>